You shot me in the ass. Hey guys, Cooper here, and today I'm going to be introducing a new addition kind of thing to the channel, and that is the Angry Interracial Game Crew Tip of the Week. And today I'm going to start off with how to enchant any weapon or item extremely easily, completely free, and you can even do it on one of the first quests you ever go on to. So all you need to do is... Um, uh, go to any oblivion gate uh, the best way to do this is to start out uh, to just do the one in Kavach so after you get out of the sewers I know after I get out of the sewers I normally go straight to Vilverin so I can uh, get a good uh, level up kind of thing going and then go straight to Kavach once you do all that kind of stuff go do the uh, oblivion gate and uh, I'm not going to go through the whole thing because that will take a while because this is a really hard gate that I chose to go to which was dumb but alright so it's a pretty easy thing it's kind of an exploit uh, I wouldn't call it a glitch because it isn't or a cheat or anything it's just an exploit uh, so let's see alright oh jeez that's loud um, so I just went to the very end of it uh, what you want to do you want to save uh, to a new uh, save two times that's what I did so I have two saves that are exactly the same and uh, you'll go over to the Citadel Stone take that once you see the little tiny dot disappear as soon as you see that disappear you go to your inventory and go over to uh, their uh, miscellaneous and go all the way down until you find your Sigil Stone and if it's a good one and keep that if not all you have to do if you don't like it just go to load and go down to uh, your last save and just uh, keep doing that until you find whichever one you want I'm gonna go ahead and get one or two more like I had a weapon that had I think 30 points of uh, health absorption which is uh, a very good enchantment and it doesn't matter on your magicka like your magicka has nothing to do with uh, how many times you can use it or how good it is so it's better to do this way I think than to do ah screw it this is fine um, than to do the whole thing at the mages guild which you have to go you have to be completely in the mages guild which takes forever and then you can enchant stuff and it all depends on how good your magic is and what spells so I like this way much better it's easier you can get better stuff uh, use the duplication glitch that I have addressed previously uh, to duplicate your sigil stones as much as you want uh, so that you can enchant any other weapon or whatever in the same way so if this thing will load I swear if this thing is fun, okay. When you duplicate a sigil stone, I don't know. I, I'm pretty sure it doesn't have a different effect, though. So, and it can get really loud and bassy. So if you have a, if you have your uh, uh, TV turned up, I would turn it down before you watch this, or if you do it, so it can get very loud and annoying. I'll just grab two, I guess. I grabbed three on accident. Alright, well, that way I can, uh, I guess I'll go ahead and enchant my Daedric Longsword. Alright, so now I have a pretty good weapon right here with a good enchantment, a strong enchantment, uh, 70 uses, which is pretty good for that. And it's already got a good amount of damage. So, uh, that's it for today. And hope you enjoyed next week's episode you shot me in the ass